Hello basketball coaches and basketball players. My name is Alan from Al's Basketball Training and today I'm gonna to teach you how you can dribble this basketball between your legs. So hello everyone, my name is Alan from Al's Basketball Training. If you're new to this channel, on this channel I usually show you basketball plays, drills, and skills. And on Tuesdays and Thursdays, those skills are individual skills and not team stuff. All the other days are team drills, skills, and plays. But anyways, today I'm going to show you an individual skill that you might be searching for and trying to figure out how you can learn how to do this. And that is dribbling this basketball between your legs. So let's just get down to it. So to be able to dribble a basketball through the legs, you don't need that much room really. Basically, all you need is a driveway. You could do this at a basketball court as well, but if you want the privacy of not having everyone know that you can't dribble the ball between your legs, drive, driveway is a fantastic spot, and that's why I am here today. If you can see that in the background, yeah, that's my Mustang. Uh, it's a bit dirty, I need to wash it. Um, for any of you car lovers, there's some eye candy for you. because that looks a lot better than I do. But anyways, so let's get down to it. All you really need to know how to do is be able to do a crossover just like that. That is almost just as simple as it is. However, instead of just being in front of you, it's going to be underneath of you. So you're gonna have your leg in front of the other. You're gonna have about enough room for at least the basketball. You want there to be a little bit more room anyways. And all you need to do is just basically dribble the ball between your legs. That seems really simple when you're talking about it or seeing it, other people who are doing it who already know how to do it. But if it's your first time, I bet this is gonna be super hard. So let me give you some pointers. First of all, dribble the basketball, have it bounce right in between your feet. Just like that. Not before, because it's gonna sack you, and not after your feet, because it's gonna go way over there. And you don't really want that. So you want it to bounce right in between those feet, right directly underneath of you. So that is one very helpful tip that will help you be able to cross the ball between your legs. Now it's the same thing when you wanna go the other direction. So if you wanna go this way, same idea. And a few easy drills that you can do yourself to be able to dribble the ball between your legs is for one being in one spot and just crossing it like this. Of course, in a game, this is a double dribble, but when you're in your driveway, it's not. Another way is to go the other way. And then when you get that under control, you can now go back and forth between your legs. So it's gonna look like this. You can dribble a few times on one side if you want, and if you want, you can just continue through, just like that. And it seems really easy when I'm doing it, but I bet you anything, your first time might be a bit more difficult. But I hope that these tips help you. Another one that has helped me when I was younger be able to dribble the basketball between their legs is by walking and doing it. So you wanna be able to walk. Am I still on camera? I think I am. But basically, this driveway isn't exactly level, but we're gonna try it anyways. You're just gonna walk just like that. And you can go slow, and you can go fast, you can go faster, it's up to you. And you can even go behind, from behind your leg as well, just like that. It's okay if you mess up. This driveway isn't exactly level, just like that. Anyways, that is some tips that you might be able to like, and I hope you like that Mustang. That might be in a few more of my videos. It looks damn nice. Now anyways, those are some tips and drills that you can do if you're looking to dribble the basketball between your legs. If you like this stuff, hit that like button and subscribe. I do post new videos every single day, so of course I'll see you guys again tomorrow for another daily basketball video.